Many people believe that in Demon Slayer the swords have magic, like the flames that come out of Rengoku's sword for example, but the answer is no, those are just representations that are not really there, and this can be seen in the anime itself, since Rengoku's techniques don't burn enemies, and Tanjiro's techniques also don't make the scenery or enemies wet. Many people think that Yurokodaki wears a mask to hide some secret or even scars on his face, but he actually wears a mask to look scarier, since when he was a Hashira of the demons were making fun of him for having a very kind face. When Tanjiro receives his sword, and the blade turns black, his master is worried, since according to the ancestors, demon slayers with black blades tend to die sooner than others, because according to the ancestors these slayers have more difficulty learning the breaths, but actually the black swords in Demon Slayer belong to the most talented hunters, and they have more difficulty learning the other breaths because in fact they should be learning a much more powerful style, which is the breath of the sun. Inosuke can't remember anyone's name, he already called Tanjiro Tuntaro Adadaki, Kenjiro Anego, Manjiro Kenduru among other funny names. Zenitsu was the only character in the work who was not a Shira and who managed to defeat a superior moon without any help, using a style that he himself developed within his breath. The moon's breath is the only one in Demon Slayer that doesn't have any successors, being used only by Michikatsu, who is the number one superior moon. In the Rangoka family there is a tradition that when women become pregnant they stare into the fire for a long time, which is supposedly why all men are born with that color hair that looks like flames. Yurichi was the only one who managed to live for more than 25 years with the Demon Slayer mark awakened. When an Oni encounters a Sun Breath user who has the Demon Slayer mark, the demon shudders and shivers as its body recognizes that Demon Slayer as its natural predator. Musen's body anatomy is very unique, he has seven hearts and five brains, which keep moving and changing places in his body, and all twelve organs need to be hit at the same time to kill the King of Demons. Musen, despite being very powerful, Musen is very afraid of dying, and he feels no shame in running away if he feels that his life is threatened. Jayomi I was blinded by a very high fever he had in childhood, but despite that he is the most powerful Ashira. The Ashira of Mist Muchiro Takedo is a direct descendant of Kakushibu, who is the number one superior moon. Sanami's blood is of a very special and rare type, capable of attracting the Oni much more and having a nutritional value for them, equivalent to that of hundreds of people, that's why everyone was so surprised when Nezuko turned her face towards the blood of the Hashira. Hashira Mitsuri was originally a flame breath user, and was trained by Kayajuro Rengoku, but that breath wasn't suitable for her body, so she ended up creating the breath of love. Nezuko's Kekijutsu has a strong healing effect when used on humans, but if used against an Oni, it has a destructive effect that burns the demon like the sun itself. Mitsuri's hair, according to her, turned that color after eating too much Sakuramachi. Zenitsu, despite fighting in his sleep most of the work, during the final battle against Muzen, he remains awake the entire time. Only four Onis managed to get rid of Muzen's domination during the work, they are, Miss Tamayo, Nezuko, Akaza, and Kokushibo. Yurichi despite being always surrounded by several skilled hunters, had a lot of difficulty finding someone who could inherit his breath, as most people who use the breath of the sun, could not make the movements perfectly, and ended up creating other breaths, derived from that. The reason Shinobu never awakened her demon slayer mark is that she stayed away from Tanjiro, as to awaken the mark you need to stay close to someone who has the mark for long periods of time. If Kaijuro Rengoku had stayed longer with Tanjiro before facing Akasa, there is a high chance that he would awaken the Demon Slayer mark and thus kill Akasa at the end of the battle. The box that Nezuko is in is made of a special wood that does not allow the sun to pass through and is extremely resistant, so she can sleep peacefully inside the box. Inosuke didn't have any kind of training, he created his own breath with his eleven forms without the help of any other hunter. Sanemi Shinazugawa already hunted demons long before becoming a Ashira, he captured Onis and killed them with sunlight, until one day on his journey he ended up meeting a demon slayer and that's why he joined the hunter's organization. Tanjiro inherited his hard forehead from his mother, who had a forehead so hard that she was able to kill a wild boar with just one blow. Tanjiro and Inosuke are partially deaf and they cannot identify certain types of sounds, while Zenitsu has extremely acute hearing, being able to hear people approaching from long distances. 
Some of Mitsuri's attacks are named after cats, because she had a cat as a child. The Superior Moon number 1 has already been challenged three times for its position, and one of those battles was against Akaza, usually Kokushibo absorbed the Oni he defeated, but with Akaza he didn't because he liked the challenge. Muzan doesn't like Doma very much, mainly because of his personality, but tolerates him because he is very strong. The night that Susamaru and Yahaba went to attack Miss Tamayo's house, it was the first time the two met, and they became friends talking all the way there. According to Tanjiro, all of the Demon Slayer's crows have a name, and his crow is called Matsuman Tanuji. According to the author, Abunai is one of the weakest Hashiras in terms of physical strength, and he probably wouldn't do well in an arm wrestling match against the other Hashiras. Gyako is Musen's favorite high moon, because his vases are quite beautiful, and sell for a very high price. Even though Musen was very fond of Baki, the true holder of the position of superior moon number 6 was Chitaro, who was also one of the Demon King's favorites. Daki and his red light organization, was one of Musen's biggest sources of income, and that's why he liked her even though she wasn't that strong. Shinobu's original uniform was open in the front like Mitsuri's, but Shinobu burned it, and had another one made, this time with buttons. Shinobu has an amount of poison in its body 700 times more than enough to kill an Oni, so if an Oni eats it, it won't be a very good experience. Shinobu's poison is created by herself inside the scabbard of her sword, but no one knows how this process is done, except for her and her blacksmith. Each of the five new demon slayers that we saw pass in the final selection have one of their five senses enhanced, Kaneo the sight, Sunitsa the hearing, Tanjiro the smell, Inasuk the touch, and Jenya the taste. The events of Demon Slayer take place between 1912 and 1926 in Japan. There are two ways to become a Hashira, killing 50 Oni or one of the 12 moons, or becoming an apprentice to one of the Hashira. Uchiro wears baggy clothes to disorient enemies so they can't see his joint movements, and thus make it harder for enemies to predict his movements. The boar head that Inosuke wears is that of his mother boar who had lost her calf and raised it when it fell in the forest. All Ashiras have the inscription destroy the Onis forged on their weapons, the only exception is Shinobu, which has the phrase, Onis are evil. At the end of the series, after the events of the story, Zenitsu writes a memoir called The Legend of Zenitsu, in which he probably exaggerated his own accomplishments a bit. Due to Zenitsu's keen hearing, he is very good at music, possessing the ability to play various string musical instruments. Kaijuro Rengoku is partially deaf, as during his first mission he had to break his own eardrums in order not to fall under the effect of the flute's oni. Yurichi's blade, like Tanjiro's, was also black, but when he went to exterminate an oni, his sword changed to a crimson red hue. Jenya is a demon slayer with the ability to eat oni flesh and use kekijutsu, which are those special powers that some onis possess, and because of this strange ability he is always undergoing medical examinations. Jenya is the only demon slayer who does not know how to use any type of breath, using only abilities derived from the oni flesh he eats. Jutomioka and Sanemi Shinazugawa even though they survived the final battle against Muzan, they died as soon as they reached the age of 25, due to the curse of the Demon Slayer mark. The genetic disease passed down from generation to generation in the Abuyashiki family, leaves family members with weak bodies and a lifespan of less than 30 years. The Tamioka crow is considered an elderly bird, so it tends to make mistakes and give incorrect messages. Sanemi is missing a few fingers from his hands, and he lost them in the course of his many battles with Onis. Mitsuri's flax sword exists in the real world, and it's called Yurumi. In addition to using water and sun breath, Tanjiro is also capable of using thunder breath. Memories of human life are not erased from the mind of the Oni but repressed, and the Oni can regain their memories upon suffering very severe physical damage. After becoming Oni, Muzan had five wives, but failed to keep any of the five marriages. Miss Tamayo has been alive since ancient times, and is at least 500 years old. Yashiro is a great admirer of Tamayo and has a secret diary, in which he writes everything about her and how amazing she is. Yashiro and Nezuko are the only two Onis in the entire work, who have never devoured any human. Akasa is the only Oni who refuses to harm human women, 
and he has a special permission for Musen to do so, this behavior is related to his life as a human. When he was alive, Akasa had a bride, and her name meant Snowflake, and we can see a snowflake being depicted in some Akasa strokes. In the original Japanese, Akasa's voice is performed by the same actor who voices Gara in Naruto. Inosuke and Tenjen Yuzui are the only demon slayers in the entire work that use two swords. The demon slayer mark is derived from Yurichi, who was the first human to be born with the mark, it draws all of the person's strength and power, greatly reducing their lifespan. The blue spider lily that Musen so desires does not exist in the real world, but the red spider lily does, and is referred to in various cultures as a mystical plant. Tanjiro is the living being with the greatest ability to withstand Musen's blood. The Onis need to devour many humans or receive a large amount of Musen's blood to use advanced techniques, but Nezuko manages to use techniques of the level of the upper moons without devouring a single human. The kanji written on the back of Sanami's clothes are for the word kill. Jiomiya is the only one of the Ashuras who doesn't use a sword, as his weapon is a kind of chain, with an axe on one end and a club on the other. Takedo is the only one of the Ashuras who fought a superior moon alone and managed to defeat it without any help. Takedo holds the absolute record for being the fastest demon slayer to become Ashura, taking just three months after first wielding a sword. Shinobu's parents were both in compounding medicine, and that's where his knowledge and talent with medicine comes from. Calling Flame Ashura Fire Ashura isn't exactly incorrect, as in Japanese, the words flame and fire don't have much difference in meaning and are spelled practically the same. Zenitsu's grandfather Jigoro ceased to be Ashura after losing part of one of his legs in combat, which caused him to retire. Mizuko only attacked a human once in the work, and that happened during the Entertainment District arc when she lost control of her demonic transformation. Zenitsu told all the other demon slayers that he was Nezuko's boyfriend, and asked that no one else get close to her. Jayo Tamioka's outfit has two different patterns, the checkered side references Hayori Sabido, the red side references her older sister's outfit, both gave their lives to protect Jayo. Some members of the Ubuyashiki family have the ability to foretell the future, and this ability has made them very wealthy. According to Tanjiro himself, his father was much more talented than he was. Jiomiai was the only character in the work who managed to consciously activate the Demon Slayer mark, everyone else activated it by instinct. Inosusk is extremely similar to his mother, to the point that Toma recognizes the face immediately even after many years. Before he died, Tanjiro's father passed on to him all his knowledge about the Breath of the Sun and the Demon Slayer mark, but it was all through stories and metaphors that were only later understood by Tanjiro. Musen still has the marks of Yurichi's red blade all over his body, these marks guided the Demon Slayers during the final battle, and it was said by Musen that those cuts burned for several years even after Yurichi's death. Kaigaku only became an Oni, three days after drinking the blood of the Superior Moon Number 1. And because he was very strong, after becoming a demon he went straight to the position of Superior Moon number 6. When they enter the organization, demon slayers need to make a letter with their last message that will be sent to their family in case something happens to them. Yurichi's relationship with the Superior Moon number 1 references the Japanese legend of the sun and moon gods. Kakushibu the Superior Moon number 1 has 6 eyes because it is the amount he deemed necessary to be able to follow Yurichi's blows. Doma fell in love with Shinobu, so much so that he asked her to go to hell to be with him. Abanai, the Ashura of the Serpent, was recruited and saved by the Ashura of the Flames, who at the time was Kaijuro Rengoku's father. The Breath of the Sun only survived because of the Kamadu family's lineage, as Musen and Kokushibo killed every user that appeared in the 500 years after Yurichi's death. Inside every Oni there is a small part of Musen, which is reading and even controlling his thoughts. In Demon Slayer reincarnation is a thing that happens and the reincarnated people have the exact same face as the previous incarnation, and even the same scars. When a Demon Slayer becomes an Oni, even though he doesn't remember his past life, he doesn't lose any of his techniques or combat experience. Ordinary hunters receive fixed salaries for eliminating Onis, while Ashuras receive high commissions for eliminations. In the author's original idea, Musen was not a demon but a vampire, 
This explains the many similarities with vampire works that Demon Slayer has, such as the use of blood, and the fact that sunlight is lethal to the Onis. The author of Demon Slayer left a note at the end of the work with an apology, in case she was not able to please all the fans with the ending she produced. The author of Demon Slayer told in an interview that she was inspired by four stories to create the work, and these stories are, Gintama, Jojo's Bizarre Adventure, Naruto, and Bleach. That's it guys, if you liked the video consider subscribing to the channel to follow my content. Until next time my people, Demonic Hugs.